This is the Hyperdrive USB-C dock for the 2018 iPad Pro. It's a single USB-C plug opposite a medley of other ports. So let's take a look at it and we'll go over why you should consider picking one up. Hyper is offering a 6-in-1 USB-C dock that houses a 3.5mm headphone jack, a full-size HDMI port, USB-A, USB-C, SD, and microSD ports. Now that's definitely the most we've seen on a dedicated iPad Pro USB-C hub thus far. Within that list of ports though are a few things worth touching on. The USB-C port supports data as well as power delivery which means your iPad can charge and sync at the same time which is really convenient. The USB-A port here is a high speed port and the USB-C port is capable of speeds up to 5 gigabits a second of transfer speed which is pretty impressive. The micro SD and SD slots are UHS-1 capable at around 100 megabytes a second transfer rate which isn't the fastest but still good to have nonetheless. Now if you're looking for the best HDMI output for your new iPad Pro you're not going to get it while using a hub unfortunately. The hyperdrive can deliver a signal at 1080p at 60Hz as well as 2K resolution at 60Hz. Most of the hubs out in the market right now including the hyperdrive only supports 4K at 30Hz, but the iPad Pro supports 4K at 60Hz. Now with an HDMI connection, especially on hubs, we usually run into an audio issue where the iPad will route the audio through the hub, regardless if headphones are connected. Now that's not the case with the hyperdrive. It'll only reroute the audio when a wired headphones are plugged into the hub, which is really neat. Now speaking of audio, one thing that some people miss from the 2018 iPad Pro is that dedicated headphone jack. When Apple announced the new iPad Pro late last year with its new modern design, Apple decided to ditch that headphone jack altogether and go all out on wireless audio with AirPods. Thankfully the hyperdrive has this built in so you don't have to use another dongle to plug it into that USB-C port to listen to music with wired headphones. Overall design though, I think this is what sets the hyperdrive apart from others the most, and it's all thanks to that removable PVC clip. This slim accessory helps keep the hyperdrive hub stable and evenly distributes the weight across the entire edge of the iPad and not just the USB-C port in the center. This makes a huge difference, it easily stops the hub from disconnecting accidentally and that can happen quite often with other hubs we've tried. The removable clip works with or without the smart keyboard, but if you have a case that doesn't fit, just remove the clip and you're good to go. Now USB-C hubs are great for the new iPad Pro, but practical applications are still somewhat limited by iOS. We're hoping that this upcoming WWDC and when Apple officially announces iOS 13 with better file management, real multitasking, and support for external storage devices, a lot more people we'll see the big advantages of USB-C hubs like this one from Hyper. Now we obviously can't confirm whether we will see those features from Apple, but here's to hoping. So what do you think? Are you looking to pick up a hyperdrive? If so, let us know in the comments down below and let's start a conversation. Until next time, we'll see you in the next one. Hey everyone, did you guys like that video? Be sure to click on that like button so we can create content that we know that you guys want to see. And follow Apple Insider on all social media channels. If you want the best prices on any Apple gear, check out the Apple Insider price guide that is updated daily. And until next time, we'll see you later.